in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to uh, use the select cases in AS SPSS um, I'm using SPSS 17 as you can see here uh, but I'm pretty sure this version is out uh, this feature is also available in older and of course newer versions of SPSS uh, here's a scenario let's say I want to select specific records in my data set um, let's say I want records that have one in the, uh, the values 1 and 2 under the, var the variable position um, I can do that by going to data select cases and then under select by default all cases are selected uh, I want to choose if condition is satisfied and then click if I have done this in the past so I'm going to delete here and then again the variable of interest is position so I'm going to transfer position to the right hand side and then uh, complete the, uh, the function I need the equal sign and I need the number number one so I just type number one after the equal sign if I uh, stop here and uh, click continue and click OK I can see my data set now uh, has changed and only the values or records that have one the value one under the position uh, under the variable position is now selected everything else is crossed out as you can see here and will not be considered for for example a descriptive statistic that I run uh, on SPSS from this point on so but again uh, my original uh, problem hasn't hasn't been solved yet because I need number two as well so I'm gonna go back and uh, go to the same place select cases if and then here I might want to use the the or uh, option uh, it's just that option right there it's a little bar um, and then I have to repeat this uh, particular piece of the function so I'm gonna have to go back to oops I'm gonna click there and then click on the um, position again and transfer to the right hand side and then repeat the equal sign and then instead of one now two um, all records that have one and two um, as values for the variable position will be selected next so I'm gonna, I'm gonna to continue and OK and take a look at the data uh, as you can see and it, as expected one and two now are available for me to proceed and run an analysis for example now let's say I want to uh, unselect uh, or go back to uh, the default uh, so what I have to do is to go back to data select cases and then simply click all cases selected uh, or all cases and all cases will be available for a particular analysis that I decide to run so I'm going to click OK and uh, inspect my data again and then everything is now available uh, all the records will be available for for a particular analysis that I run in SPSS I hope this helps